Hi, y'all. Do Democrats care more about elections than Republicans? They certainly work harder to restructure elections to their liking. The Mississippi House of Representatives has 122 members. Of those, 76 are Republicans and 46 are Democrats. Well, I think 45 are Democrats and one independent, but Angela Cockerham, I believe, Cockerham, she, uh, she calls herself an independent, but she votes Democrat, so effectively 46 Democrats. Despite the importance of election integrity, Republicans only put forward 13 bills during this year's legislative session. Those 46 Democrats, they put forward 46 bills. That's one bill for every Democrat in the House. And what about the Senate? At 36 to 16, Republicans have more than twice as many senators than the Democrats. Still, they barely managed to propose more election legislation than the Democrats did, proposing a mere 24 bills to the Democrats' 21. Of course, it's not all about the numbers. There are five major areas of concern. I'm sure I'm leaving some out, but these are the five top areas of concern for election reform. That is voter ID, voter rolls, mail-in voting, early voting, and voter registration. Of the bills that were proposed by Republicans in both houses, most of them had nothing to do with any of these big issues. Most relate to small or local matters. And uh, while I'm sure they're all important in their own way, the five issues listed before are paramount. And of the Republican election legislation proposed, only three House bills and five Senate bills even tried to address these big issues. But a whole lot of the election legislation proposed by the Democrats addressed these five issues. The Democrats are winning because they never quit pushing. Election integrity is the single most important issue of our time. Without fair and honest elections with verifiable results, all else is lost. Our elected representatives' opinions on freedom of speech, religious liberty, gun control, None of that matters without free and fair elections. The current attempts in Congress to federalize elections make these issues urgent, but Republicans' actions don't reflect this urgency. What little legislation they did propose failed to pass. Of the eight bills the Republicans put forward in both houses, only one even made it out of committee. HB 4 was designed to maintain clean voter rolls. It included an Ohio-style use-it-or-lose-it clause, wherein if you don't vote for, uh, over the course of four years in any election, and the four years has to be in a span that includes two presidential elections, because those are the elections most people vote in, then you are taken off the voter rolls. Now, that doesn't mean you lose your right to vote. It just means that if you want to vote, you have to go register again. Ohio has used this type of legislation to great effect, but despite being authored by nine representatives, that is, what, 7% of the House of Representatives co-authored the bill, it still wasn't brought to the floor for a vote. Most Republicans rank election integrity as the single most important issue. This concern should be reflected in Republican legislation, but in the 2021 legislative session in Mississippi, it was not. We deserve better. It's time to demand better. Thanks for listening, y'all.